Ricky Ricky is leading all the morning stars. The lone turbo car strikes again. Lightning strikes again. Deja vu, whatever you want to call it. The U.S. Nationals winner right here, Lyle Barnett. Does it again over Chris Thorne, but in round one. Thank God, man. I've said it all weekend long. We're in the, this is the seventh race of the Fuel Tech uh, NHRA Pro Mod season powered by D-Wagon. And, uh, and I think I've raced Chris This is the seventh race, and I think I've raced Chris Thorne nine times, it feels like. We seem to match up with each other every race. Uh, obviously, in the finals at the U.S. Nationals, and uh, in, in familiar fashion of late, he turned red against me, and we won uh, here in the first round. He's 003 red again, and uh, and we beat him in round one. The point leader, um, you know, I told him when the day started, I said, look, I'm trying to make this a bad day for you in an early trip back to Florida and make this points championship tough for you here at the end of the year, and we've managed to do it. Uh, we had a pretty rocky start to the season. Um, just haven't ran as good as we really knew we could. And here over the past couple races, we really turned it on. I mean, that's four passes down this racetrack. A to B every run in the mid 70s. Qualified with a 572 at 257 and a half. And uh, and Justin Elks, my crew chief, just got this thing running. Ben Stoss, my girl, and my dad work on this thing between rounds and give me something at least for the moment that is uh, is going to be tough to beat today. So three more rounds to get it done, and hopefully going to bring a Wally back home here at my home track. Lyle, very quickly, marketing partners can be hard to come by in Pro Mod. You got a new set of vinyl on the door this yeah. weekend. Yeah, so I had a flood uh, in my kitchen earlier this year, and uh, Jonathan Birch and the Birch Brothers Flooring Company out of Raleigh helped me out, got me fixed up. Uh, had a brand new baby. Had a brand new baby at home, and you know, it needed to get the floors fixed. And they they came in there and did a really great job. Um, I called Jonathan a couple weeks ago said, look, man, I'm going to my home race. I don't really have anything new to go on the doors. What do you think? And he said, absolutely, man. So I'm happy to have the Birch Brothers on, on board. Uh, if you're looking for flooring expertise in, in, the, in the Carolinas, Virginia, uh, anywhere here in the Southeast, Birch Brothers are the, are the people to call me. They did an outstanding job, great customer service. And, uh, and I really appreciate Jonathan and everybody at Birch Brothers for their help this weekend. Those darn fuel cars, but Lyle faces Stevie, round two. Yes, sir. All right, all right, all right. Give me 
WWE World Champ. Still have to worry about Ricky. Round 573-9250 for Jose Gonzalez at a 12 reaction time. I think they were reaching their own trailer going, I gotta fix 
154 miles an hour, makes his best run of the weekend. Stevie Fast Jackson ain't ready to give up yet. He gets his first win since here at the Four Wides in 2001. And for Justin Bond, a 574, another solid You're looking at the hot rod of Stevie Fast Jackson, and Gapplebee's was served today. You picked up a Wally. It's been a little while, though, Stevie. You know, the best way to win Charlotte is in a car named Charlotte, right? It's been a long time since we raced. Uh, what's more exciting than winning this is running my teammate in the final. Uh, we have been struggling team-wide this whole season. We've had a bunch of unfortunate accidents and mishaps, but being able to run Justin in the final, we talked about it before the race, we already had won. And when you go up there and you know that you've already won, uh, one of these two red and white cars going to winter circle, it really takes the pressure off unless you just go have fun. At the end of the day, drag racing is supposed to be fun. Uh, it's been a while since we won. This is an 18-month hiatus, and I uh, told my crew a while ago I like winning better than I like losing. Stevie, Fast Jackson, and what happened here at Charlotte makes the points race interesting. Yeah, oh boy, they better not count me out. 